Since 1875, the men and women of the Marine Engineers Beneficial Association, MEBA, have served their country through adversity and hardships. During wartime, they have supported the country's critical need for military sea lift power. In peacetime, their role in moving domestic and international cargo has been vital to America's economy. The Marine Engineers Beneficial Association began in 1875, supporting the elevation and maintenance of rights of the steamboat engineers. As technology advanced, so did the strength and purpose of the Union. Today, with the vision of its founding fathers, MEBA supports over 6,000 U.S. Coast Guard licensed Marine Engineers, deck, and radio officers. Most are graduates of Maritime Academies and MEBA's own engineering school, many with advanced degrees. The MEBA is like its members, professional and well-managed. The union's fully funded pension plan is the healthiest in the maritime industry, requiring no contributions from employers. Members enjoy the benefits of full health and dental insurance plans and a 401k supplemental retirement plan. Trained extensively, these men and women crew technologically advanced ships in the U.S. flag fleet and understand the importance of updating their skills to perform effectively. As marine technology rapidly advances, MEBA officers continually upgrade their skills throughout their careers. That's why MEBA officers have the most extensive range of expertise in the world including crude oil and product tankers, LNG carriers, bulk carriers, container ships, brake bulk freighters, lash vessels, large passenger ferries, tugs, and a variety of service type vessels. MEBA engineers also have diesel, steam, and gas turbine experience. They have even manned the world's first and only nuclear-powered merchant vessel, the NS Savannah. To keep a stronghold on all technological advances, the MEBA member takes part in lifelong training through the Union. MEBA supports this endeavor through tuition reimbursed training classes at the foremost maritime institutions in the nation. But the keystone of the MEBA educational program is the renowned Calhoun MEBA Engineering School in Easton, Maryland, where the preeminent maritime engineering curriculum in the world is offered. The Calhoun Engineering School is funded by a training plan with over $70 million in assets. The cost of MEBA employers is only 10 cents per day. MEBA's primary philosophy to provide the best well-rounded training for its members demonstrates itself repeatedly in the Calhoun school environment. The school's motto is providing knowledge not just a license. Training periods are flexible usually between two to six weeks. This allows the MEBA Mariner the opportunity to schedule training during vacation or short time periods. Everybody's here because they want to be here they're not forced to come here. They're here because they want to advance themselves, because they want to learn. The school is always trying to keep uh, the membership of our union abreast of any current changes there are in the uh, maritime industry and all the technology changes. The Calhoun School provides education on every marine subject, from welding upgrading, firefighting, radar and signaling coursework, to the latest in high-tech computer hardware and software. The school was among the first to offer training and certification in refrigerant gas recovery, as mandated by international treaty. 
correspondence courses are available for members' use while at sea, some of which are supplemented by video. More specifically, course offerings include one or more of the following. Analog electronics, applied diesel, basic computers, diesel engineering, digital electronics, electricity, hazardous materials, technician and advanced firefighting, license upgrading for mates and engineers, LNG tank ship and liquefied gas, machine shop, marine engineering seminar, refrigeration, ships management, ships medicine, small arms and security standards, standard computers, tank ship safety and dangerous liquids, welding, gas turbine propulsion, first aid and CPR, vapor control and recovery. The course list is continually updated to reflect the latest in regulatory changes and technological advances. At the end of each two to six week training period, each mariner is tested rigorously to ensure that MEBA officers will perform well in the testing for the U.S. Coast Guard licensing and certification process. Through each training period, the mariner updates himself on new technology, prepares for emerging specialties, completes his understanding of the ever-changing maritime regulations, and prepares for career advancement. Training and dedication combined, these highly skilled mariners are the future of the commercial and private shipping industries, which is why MEBA officers are in demand worldwide. It was MEBA officers who pioneered the concept of crewing specialized foreign flagships with skilled American officers on the El Paso-class LNG tankers under Norwegian registry. Throughout history, mariners from the MEBA have performed vital support services for both military and civilian industries. During the Persian Gulf War, U.S. merchant ships, many manned by MEBA officers, carried over 80% of the materials and equipment needed by the U.S. and Allied forces. The underlying support by our maritime fleet helped U.S. troops win the war. Most recently, during initial operations of the 1994 Haiti action, over one million square feet of military combat equipment was moved by the Sealift fleet. Out of the 14 ready reserve cargo ships, MEBA officers crewed 11. Each of these feats exemplify the expeditious and professional support of MEBA members for the U.S. troops. As a member in the uh, Merchant Marine Naval Reserve, uh, you see both sides of the coin. You get a chance to see what the Navy has to go through as far as getting their man power and their ships uh, to a certain point. Uh, and you also see what it takes to get their supplies, uh, which would be coming from merchant vessels. And so being a merchant officer, I see both sides. I'm a lieutenant commander in the Navy, and I'm a first assistant on a commercial cargo ship. So I've gotten to see both sides of uh, what each, each organization has to go through. Yeah, pure and simple. We are highly trained. You will get your money's worth. People in this industry know how to fix things, how to get things done, how to be a supervisor, how to run departments at minimum cost. It's, it's a place you want to be. The people are here because they want to be here. And I've always found that the attitude has always been a very positive one. It's a very professional and very capable operation. Throughout the Union's 120-year history, MEBA officers have remained true to their commitment of being the most highly skilled professionals sailing the sea. With a proven record of exemplary capability, loyalty, and safety, the education and skills of MEBA officers are unprecedented throughout the world. The Marine Engineers Beneficial Association its men and women dedicated to the maritime profession, prepared to perform any task, meet any challenge, in support of our maritime industry worldwide.